this is delicious VB with another tutorial um, my second tutorial actually um, and these are random tutorials and this next tutorial will be on creating a pop-up blocker for the web browser control and we all know the web browser control it's um, in the toolbox um, web browser right here and this guys is like the first project I ever made in Visual Basic um, so yeah I know it's suckish but at least it works I think um, I think it works uh, uh, yeah go right there um, let me just make sure that go actually does something uh yeah it does wow there's actually a lot yeah okay um now this I can all delete um and let me see if there are any more things I that I won't need that will cause an error um so no that's it um but anyway let's get down to what today's tutorial is all about um so it's this tutorial is about creating a pop-up blocker now um i know it we all hate pop-ups and um if you see those major web browsers they all have pop-up blockers and these pop-up blockers are um they always work. Let me put it that way. They almost always work. And um, that's why people use these. That's one reason why um, people like these browsers. They come with these features. And one of those features is the pop-up blocker. And the pop-up blocker just blocks any pop-up. Duh. And um, you don't say. And um, people hate pop-ups because they just they interrupt you with your work so um today i'll be teaching you how to create a pop-up blocker with the web browser control so um click on your web browser control okay it should say web browser one or whatever you named it here by the way i created this yeah i already told you i created this already um look for another tutorial on youtube on how to make a web browser i may i might make one soon though um which means if you're watching this a while after it came out, there's probably one that I made. Um, so check out my channel and subscribe. Anyway, so click on your web browser control and go to this little events thing. It looks like a lightning strike kind of thing. So click on that and it gives you like a list of events kind of thing. And um, let's go to new window because pop-up is just a new window that's all the pop-up is and you see <clears throat> by val e as system dot component model dot cancel event args cancel event arguments i think that's what it is so we want to say e okay e which is which is um by val you see and this bival for all of you those beginners it basically means dim you know that dim thing right there except in a more advanced way and i'm not going to get into that but e dot and then here is just anything but there is one thing here cancel e dot cancel okay and some people might think well cancel it well, that's not going to work because you're setting a value. So you want to say e dot cancel equals true, and that just cancels making the new window. Now the only problem with this is when you um open a link and it's supposed to open in a new tab, but your this web browser that you made probably doesn't support opening links in new tabs and I'll open it in a new window but since it's canceling the new window it won't open it but anyway this is just a, a pop-up kind of blocker thing so we don't need to worry about that so anyway let's just um 
go to start debugging. And also, if you want to, you can um, show a message box saying that you blocked the pop-up if you were, really want to block advertise on how amazing your pop-up blocker is. But um, I think it just defeats the purpose because it also interrupts your work. Um, but anyway, and it's also, if you want to, it just shows you. I'm going to do it because it's just a little test kind of thing, and it shows you the pop-up was blocked and it kind of just shows you um when you're testing it after you test it you can delete it but it just shows you while you're testing it it tells you the pop-up was blocked so let's run it um and this is my beautiful beautiful web browser um and um yeah so it's my beautiful web browser couldn't be more beautiful um so let's just google search um <coughs> pop test pop-up blocker and we'll find some good site um um let's just go to this one this first one pop-up test let's scroll um, okay, here. Click here. Okay, click on any of the links below. You should see a new browser window open. Now, see, it says a pop-up is blocked. Um, you see. Um, so that's why I'm giving you an example of, oops, of what what can happen um anyway let's go to the second one so we can actually test it um click here to start it and it just the pop-up was blocked test okay pop-up was blocked so it blocks all these pop-ups and um now this one test not passed so that's a thing that I'm gonna say it doesn't work every single time but most of the time it does work um and if you want to go deeper you can research modeless dialogues modeless dialog pop-ups and maybe you can find a solution I'm not gonna do it in this um, video just for the sake of time but anyway you see you get the an idea most tests it passes okay passes so um that's pretty much it for this tutorial make sure to leave a like um rate it which is basically leaving a like and comment on it um give me what you think is what you think um if you have any codes or if you have any questions on this or you there some errors appear when you're creating this or if simply you just want to say good video or horrible video um just leave a comment and um yeah make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this come right to your inbox that's pretty much it for this video and see you next time